Welcome to this demonstration of Booker & Suter's Connects for Salesforce. A CSR is logged into Salesforce and logged into the Connects for Salesforce gadget. Agents can log in manually or automatically. Logging in via the SSO or Auto Login feature saves time since as soon as an agent logs into Salesforce, he's automatically logged into the Booker & Suter gadget and the Cisco Contact Center. For our demo, I made the gadget extra large, but the size and shape is configurable. Connects for Salesforce offers custom toolbars on the top and bottom of the gadget. This allows companies to customize the gadget to their needs without breaking our plug and play concept. By default, the agent can see his coworkers availability, which is useful when trying to contact a coworker for a transfer or conference. The agent manages the call on the Connects gadget and uses Cisco IP telephone or Cisco soft phone, such as Jabber, for the voice stream. He changes his status from not ready to ready in the voice channel and is now available to take calls. The agent can accept a customer call on the Connects for Salesforce gadget either manually or automatically. In this example, the CSR can see the customer's phone number, the number she dialed, account number, department, language, name, and status. In an actual deployment, the contact center administrator would configure the gadget to display information about the customer and her needs that's relevant and useful to the agents. In addition, the customer's information automatically popped into Salesforce. In this demo, a contact popped based on the customer's phone number, but the administrator can choose to pop based on other identifiers, such as caller entered digits, and the system will pop any matching record, not just a contact. Configurable screen pops provide agents with valuable information and save both the customer and agent time since the agent won't have to manually search for the correct record. The agent can associate any record in Salesforce with the call. In this example, he pulls up a case and clicks on the Assign Now button. He can also type notes inside the gadget and pick a wrap-up reason. If he clicks on the Call Activity button, he can view the Salesforce Call Activity record connects for Salesforce created for this call. Our gadget populated this activity with useful and relevant information, such as the agent's name, date and time, notes taken inside the gadget, manually associated records, customer's name, inbound versus outbound call type, call duration, when the call is completed, wrap-up reason, Annie, Dennis, etc. By creating and populating these call activities, Connects for Salesforce enables voice reporting in Salesforce. So a supervisor can now view Salesforce dashboards of telephony data. Let's say the agent needs assistance from another agent. He could see who's available to help. In this instance, he sees that Chris is logged in, but in the not ready state indicated by the red sphere. This is useful information because he certainly doesn't want to transfer a call to someone who isn't available. Chris goes in the ready state and Todd clicks the call button to contact him. Chris sees that it's an internal call and answers. This automatically puts the customer on hold and Todd can ask Chris if he wants to take the call. Chris might say, well, maybe what's it about? Todd can share any record in Salesforce with Chris. In this example, it's a case. Todd clicks on the Share Record button, and Chris can see Shared Record Open pop into his gadget. Chris views the case and says, oh yeah, I've handled a case like that, I'll take the call. Todd might conference in the customer, introduce her to Chris, and drop out or transfer the call. If he transfers the call, notice that Chris got the same screen pop and the same information in the gadget as Todd. So Chris knows what the call is about, who the customer is, and what the customer wants. This means the customer won't have to waste time identifying herself a second time, explaining why she called, and wait for the new agent to pull up a record. This saves time and increases customer satisfaction. Chris chooses a wrap-up reason. hangs up, picks a not ready reason, and can pick a logout reason 
if he's finished for the day. Reason codes are useful to supervisors who run reports and track agent activity. For outbound calling, notice we've telephony enabled all the phone numbers in Salesforce. To make an outbound call, the agent could click on any phone number in Salesforce. Another option is to simply type in part of a name or part of a phone number, which pulls customer contact information from Salesforce for click to dial. The more you type, the more it narrows it down. Agents or administrators can also quickly and easily create a speed dial list and click to dial these contacts from inside the gadget. Click to dial out of Salesforce or the Bukrensuter gadget is faster and more accurate than manually dialing. The purpose is to save time on every call. Now let's see how Salesforce's email to case is handled in the Connects for Salesforce gadget. A customer on the left sends an email to the company. The agent goes available for email to case. The email goes into exchange to a mailbox monitored by Salesforce. Salesforce creates a case and sends it to the agent. The agent accepts the case in the Booker and Suter gadget and it pops into the Salesforce window. The agent sees the email from the customer, opens it, and replies. Now let's take a look at text chatting. A customer on a website wants to chat with an agent. The customer clicks on the chat with us button and a form pops up. She fills in the form and requests the chat. The agent receives the chat request in the Booker and Suda gadget and accepts it. Notice that the system automatically put the agent in the not ready state for voice. If a second chat request comes in, the agent can juggle them. The system notifies the agent whenever a new chat arrives or a customer types something, which appears in a separate tab. Multi-chat reduces labor costs by allowing agents to help multiple customers simultaneously. Administrators can set up rules to determine which interaction types agent can juggle and how many at the same time. So for example, maybe three chats at the same time is okay, but a chat and a phone call at the same time isn't. So we can see that Connects for Salesforce allows agents to handle all interaction types in a single graphical user interface without leaving Salesforce. So during lulls in voice traffic, for example, agents can now answer emails and chats, thus increasing their utilization and improving service levels. Connects for Salesforce also provides a supervisor interface inside of Salesforce allowing supervisors to change agent states, call agents, silent monitor, and send broadcast messages to groups of agents. In summary, Connects for Salesforce is an out-of-the-box, easy-to-use, easy-to-implement, and feature-rich integration of Salesforce and the Cisco Contact Center.